yesterday I was getting some food out of my freezer and it got me thinking about temperature. And I was hoping you all could help me do some experiments. So you're just gonna need a few things you might already have around your house. First of all, we need some ice cubes, a metal baking tray, a porcelain dinner plate, and a wooden chopping board. Then, before we proceed, we need to make some predictions. Do we think the ice is going to melt as quickly on all of our different materials? Or do we think some things might be faster than others? Then when you're ready, take an ice cube, place it on each of your different materials. If you don't have these exact things, it doesn't matter. Just make sure you choose some things that are reasonably different. Then we watch and find out which things melt faster than others. So what we're finding out in this experiment is how heat moves through different materials. If it moves through something really, really quickly, it transfers its heat really well, then our ice cube is going to melt much faster. If the ice cube takes a long time to melt, then what we have is something called an insulator, which means that heat moves through it really slowly. Maybe you could even take this experiment one step further and you could challenge yourself to build something that can protect your icy poles from melting too quickly. Let us know how you go with your experiments and share your findings with us. Bye.